it's a worrying thought, but what would happen if Yellowstone erupted? It would start with a number of earthquakes. This would indicate the magma is rising rapidly through the crust. After this, a huge amount of ash and lava would shoot upwards to heights of around 25 kilometers, or 16 miles. Wildlife and human populations would perish, and it's said the climate itself wouldn't be the same for years. So you can imagine the worry when it was recently announced that a giant fissure was discovered. A very popular area near Jenny Lake in the Grand Teton National Park in Wyoming was closed to the public. This was because of the discovery of a giant new fissure. Rangers are now reviewing the situation and deciding whether it's safe for people. This 100-foot fissure has prompted officials to close certain areas to tourists. According to a statement from the National Park Service, the area is closed to locals and tourists until further notice. Superintendent David Vila said the following, Human safety is our number one priority, and with an abundance of caution we are temporarily closing this area. This is until we can properly assess the situation. As we have gained more knowledge of Yellowstone, people seem to be more worried. Specialists have recently come forward and said that over a two-week period, more than 200 earthquakes hit Yellowstone, and this told scientists that a huge tectonic plate shift had taken place under the surface of the Earth. It was said that two of the three warning signs had been detected, meaning there was going to be an eruption. As you can imagine, this caused panic when visitors were at the site. These warning signs include seismic activity increasing, an increase of gas outlet at the surface and the ground deforming. These recent fissures have increased tension in the area, with many people fearing the worst. US Geological Survey seismologist Harvey Benz is among those monitoring the site, and said that locals in the region would have lots of warnings, and it might be weeks or months before the volcano erupted. It was said the volcano would get more intense in regards to seismic activity, so people would know a long time in advance. If the volcano did erupt, it seems the falling lava wouldn't be much of a threat. The older Yellowstone lava flows never traveled much beyond the park's boundaries. For volcanologists, the biggest worry is wind-flung ash. The ash would be pretty devastating for the United States. The fallout would include short-term destruction of Midwest agriculture, and rivers and streams would be clogged by grey mark. However, as mentioned, scientists are not worried about there being an eruption. They're keeping a close eye on the situation. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.